For the families of this county, it is a very big deal. Uh, this will be the next step in education. Fresh start, new faces, new beginnings. Why not give it a try? Look at all the space you have here. This is nothing but opportunity. Over 30 acres, three buildings on site. We're renovating the, the first building, which they call Building A, and it is just unbelievable. Hey there, I'm Tessa Waldrop, School Director of Cherokee Charter Academy here in Gaffney, South Carolina. I want to welcome you to our job site, which is under construction at this time, but we plan on opening in August. Um, Cherokee Charter Academy is a K-5 school and we will be using the core knowledge curriculum. Uh, we will be uh, teaching your South Carolina State Standards and Eureka Math curriculum. When I was asked to be on the Charter School Board, I, I jumped right at it. This is a great opportunity for Cherokee County. Very excited about it. A great opportunity for our kids. And uh, it's the next level and the next step uh, toward uh, really getting involved with our community. This is our future leaders we're dealing with here. So often um, parents do feel, you know, you just, you don't have any options. So if you feel like your child's not being successful, if they are, you know, um, trapped, you want to say to a degree and maybe not making progress the way they should be, you, you want a different um, environment, a different setup, but you don't have anywhere to go. You know, you don't have any options. So I'm very, I think for the families of this county, it is a very big deal. Uh, Gaffney needs a charter school. It needs to know that parents have a choice. Uh, uh, having worked in the charter system before, I've seen just how parents intentionally choose schools for specific reasons. These children are going to be well-rounded. They're going to be prepared for college. Um, I know that at other schools, they have a high graduation rate, and that's something that's not as much here in Cherokee County Schools. I know they will be college-bound students who hopefully are going to come back and contribute to our community. We have cultivated a very positive uh, relationship with the district and I believe in the end the taxpayers are the winners. I mean they're getting a, a school brought back to life. Um, so I'm very happy with the relationship we're building with Cherokee County Schools. In life you want plenty of choices and plenty of options. This is going to provide a very good option for our parents, for our community, and I think this is going to be uh, very well received. It's new to everyone. We have it had this before in Cherokee County. So it's going to take a little while to get started, but I think everybody's going to be excited about the opportunity and take advantage of that opportunity. At this school, the benefit that you're going to have with this brand new staff that's had experience doing e-learning, but also with core knowledge, you got a great leader in Ms. Waldrop, and you have us as ICs that understand it as well how to operate um, e-learning. Through this entire process, you have nothing to lose whatsoever and everything to gain. Safety is very important to me and to Cherokee Charter Academy. We are prepared to you know, have our building cleaned, uh, sanitized every evening after our staff and students leave. Uh, we will be offering uh, meals that are sealed that will come to your child. Your child will be opening that meal at first. Uh, and then, of course, we are going to have the thermometers where we can take temperatures before students even get out of cars, hand sanitizing stations, reiterating, you know, hand washing, coughing and sneezing techniques, um, and then social distancing wherever we can. Um, so, you know, we will do whatever mandate, whatever state the state mandates us to do. But we are right now at this time, we are hoping to as close to normal as possible opening in August.